Thanks, Jacqueline. In about 30 minutes, Surrey County will unveil a new sign at the historic courthouse in Dobson. It's in honor of Sonker, which is being recognized in the Hungry for History Road Marker Program. And to celebrate this morning, we want to learn how to make the Surrey County delicacy. We have invited Mark Thrower now. He's joining us live. He's the executive chef at the Harvest Grill at Shelton Vineyards in Dobson. Mark, good morning. Thanks for joining us. Good morning. So tell us what are all of those ingredients that we need to make good old Sonker? Well, good old Sonker is a local tree. Um, <laughs> essentially, it's a cobbler, um, but we don't call it cobbler. We call it Sonker. It's uh, native to Surrey County. Um, with it, it's a basically we use different fruits, um, sometimes sweet potato. And um, with that, we uh, bake it in a, a cast iron skillet. Okay. Apologize for the telephone in there. Oh, that's all right. It's live television. Sorry, I have to be at the office. But anyway, with our tree, we um, bake it in a little skillet. We have, uh, this is a mixed berry. So we do blackberry, raspberry, and fresh blueberries. Okay. Um, with that, with the whipped cream. Um, and we serve that hot. We rotate our flavors. Uh, towards the fall, we do get into our apple and our um, sweet potato. Um, and it's just something that's really neat to do. It, it showcases Surrey County and the local, local deals that are going on around here. Chef Mark, how long have you been making Zonker? Um, I heard about Zonker about 10 years ago when I was working in a neighboring county and uh, didn't know much about it, but uh, I've kind of formulated a recipe that I learned in Georgia to compensate for some different ideas, you know, to make it uh, relatively nice dish to prepare. Um, so I've been making it for about a year now. Oh, okay. What about those first time makers out there? You know, doing this from home and then doing it, you know, maybe ordering or getting one from a bakery. Is it different? Um, from a bakery, you know, our nuances, we have the luxury of having different wines and um, in our Zonker, we use our blackberry wine, okay. um, which has a nice flavor to it, um, which is not necessary. Um, essentially, you can make it with any frozen fruit um, as well as fresh fruit, but the original recipe was used when fruit was in abundance and about to hit its peakness of ripeness. Um, so they would put it in a big dish and make a pastry and bake it off to feed a lot. Um, and actually the word zonker comes from a Scottish word that means gentle rolling hills, which simulates our, uh, or similar to our uh, local um, foothills area. And is it spelled with a Z and an S? Is that interchangeable? Um, to my knowledge, it's just an S, an um, S O N K E R, which uh, spell check whenever I write it on the menu. <laughs> so they hit me up on that a little bit. <laughs> I'm sure. What do you think about this recognition for Surrey County? This is exciting that you guys are unveiling this new sign. You know, later this morning, it's a big deal for you folks out there. It is a big deal. Um, there's a lot of farm country here, um, and you know, obviously, we are in the Yadkin Valley. Um, which is a wine country as well, which is was really neat to have. So uh, with that, I think it just adds a lot to the Dobson area, uh, you know, as well as our neighboring counties that, uh, you know, it's really a neat place out here. Uh, we get a lot of day trippers and so forth, but it, it, hopefully it'll bring more folks out. Absolutely, I think it will. And we appreciate you joining us, Chef Mark. And we wanna make sure folks can try Sonker at your Harvest Grill located at Shelton Vineyards. Maybe have a glass of wine or two as well. You can visit the website on your screen, sheltonvineyards.com for more information.